as the West Coast thirsts for rain, with lakes dipping to their lowest level in decades. People on the East Coast are getting hit with blinding downpours. This video from North Carolina showing what drivers faced on Interstate 95, south of Raleigh, as severe storms moved through the area. In Indiana, two children were hospitalized after a possible lightning strike near Indianapolis. And this driver taking a big risk, crossing a flooded road. In parts of Texas, days of heavy rain and flash flooding. An event in Houston called the Extreme Weather Ready Expo has been postponed because of, you guessed it, extreme weather in the forecast this weekend. But on the West Coast, it's the lack of rain posing the threat. Folsom Lake outside Sacramento is 68 feet lower than last year. That drop equivalent to a five-story building. Droughts are common in California, but experts say it's worse this year due to a lack of snow and higher elevations, combined with hotter, drier weather. The before and after pictures at Lake Orville from 2016 to now are striking. The lake in Northern California is on track to drop to its lowest level in 40 years. It provides drinking water to 27 million people and water to 5 million acres of farmland. This crisis extends beyond California. The governor of Utah is now asking people to pray to end the drought there. We need more rain, and we need it now. We need some divine intervention. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.